When taking measurements for daily precipitation, liquid water equivalent of new snow, or the liquid water equivalent of the total snow depth, both new and old snow, you have the option to weigh your measurement to figure out the correct liquid depth. For this, you will need a scale, preferably a digital scale that you can measure in grams. Before you measure, make sure your scale is accurate. Record the weight of your outer cylinder without anything in it. Make sure to write it down. Then take your inner measuring cylinder and fill it to one inch exactly. Pour the water into the outer cylinder and weigh it. Subtract the weight of the outer tube from the measurement you just took to find the weight of one inch of water. From there you can see that one inch of water collected in our four inch diameter gauge weighs about 201 grams. So one hundredth of an inch would weigh about two grams. Now when you measure daily precipitation, or take a snow core sample to measure the liquid water equivalent of snow, you can measure your sample on the scale. It's important that you wipe down the outside of the outer cylinder with a towel before you weigh it. You don't want anything hanging on the outside of the cylinder to add weight and distort your measurement. Once you measure, remember to subtract the weight of your outer measuring cylinder, and you are left with the weight of the liquid. All that is left is to divide the weight by 201 grams, the weight of an inch of water inside the outer cylinder, to find the depth of your measurement as liquid water. The first time you measure snow by weighing, it's a good idea to melt the snow and remeasure to make sure your calculations are correct. Weighing your snow measurement can be particularly helpful. Not only have you saved time by not having to melt your snow, but now you have snow left over that you can repurpose.